One of my favorite game modes every single year in Madden is the Mud Draft. You don't have to spend a ton of coins on your players. You can just kind of see what the newest players play like. And if you like them, then you go get them on your actual Madden Ultimate team. Now, today I'm playing against It's D Wolf. If you guys want to check out his channel, it's down below in the description. And there's a game we've already played. And believe me, you guys want to check out. So after this video, head over to his channel, watch that video. But for now, sit back, relax. We're about to get this Mud Draft going on now. We got Adam Gates, we got Matt Nagy, and we have Sean Payton. Sean Payton's an easy one for me. I love this dude's playbook. We're going to roll with him. In round number one, who are we going to get? Okay. Ooh. Nam to Kinsu. Joey Bosa. His finesse moves in 91. That's kind of crazy. And Lane Johnson. Now, look. I've used Lane Johnson before. I wasn't a huge fan. Nam to Kinsu should probably be a beast. I'm going to give Bosa an opportunity to shine. I'm going to go with the lower ranked guy because, believe me, there's a reason why. You'll find out later. Now. Devontae Adams, CJ Anderson, or Eric Ebron. I'm going to go with Devontae Adams here because I'm hoping to get a better guy than CJ and Eric as my halfback and tight end. In round number three, we got Ty Rod Taylor, Aaron Rodgers, and Blake Bortles. Look, we got to go with Aaron Rodgers, man. He's got a little bit of speed to him. Actually, Bortles is the same speed, but Rodgers' throw ratings are like significantly better. So we're going Aaron Rodgers right here. In number four, we're getting, oh, Jalen Ramsey, AJ Bouye, and Xavier Rose. Wow, okay. 93 man covers, 92 zone, and then 93, 92. Okay, press is 94, 93 there. Look, I got to go with Jalen Ramsey. He is the sassiest player in all the NFL. It's easy to pick him on that one. Uh, round number five gives us Mitchell Schwartz, Jerry Hughes, and Ali Marpet. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and get a right tackle. Actually, let's go right guard. We'll get Marpet for our right guard. I'm hoping we get a better offensive line throughout this. In number six, we're going to see Demarius Thomas, Robert Alford, and HaHa ha Clinton Dix. Uh, do we have any receivers so far? I don't even remember at this point. Okay, we got Devontae so far. Uh, you know what? Just in case we're going to get a really good corner, I'm going to get Robert Alford to be one of my second-rated guys or third-rated guys. Now, the draft pool is not being too kind to me because we're seeing Yannick Ngaku, EJ Gaines, and Jake Ryan. Not super, like, jazzed by any of these guys. We're going to take Yannick in hopes that we get better players at the other positions. Now, here we go. This is the round we're waiting for. I got AJ Green, I got Zach Ertz, and we have Odell Beckham Jr. You already know who I'm going with, Odell Beckham Jr. for sure on that one. Round number nine gives us Brandon Scherf, Kenny Clark, and Jarrell Casey. Ooh, okay. I think we're gonna go, already have a right guard, which is unfortunate because he's rated higher. I think I'm gonna go deep with some tackle here. Get a big guy to help plug the middle up some. Round number 10 is gonna give us Stefan Tua, Kyle Long, and Jason Kelsey. We're gonna go with Jason Kelsey. Highest overall player here, and we need a center for sure on our squad. Number 11, finally a couple of higher rated players here. Justin Houston, Chris Jones, and Jair Alexander. I think we're going to go Justin Houston. I don't really have a good outside linebacker yet, so I want to make sure we get somebody that can help us across all facets of the game. Now, this is what I'm talking about. I went rounds like this more often. We got Earl Thomas III, we got Landon Collins, and we have Tredavious White. Now, I already have a really good corner. I need a safety, so uh, Earl Thomas... Welcome to the team, young fella. Round number 13 gives us another low-key trash round, for being perfectly honest here. Uh, I think we're going to try to go... How do we go Deshaun Jackson? Just from the fact of, like, getting kick returns and a speedy guy in the slot. So we'll take Deshaun Jackson there. 14 gives us Michael Bennett, Anthony Barr, and Devondre Campbell. I actually don't even know who that is. Uh, Anthony Barr, though, might be the move. He's a tall guy, 6'5", good speed. It's a lot of interceptions, typically, so we're going to run with him. In 15, we got Chandler Jones, brother of John Jones, Quan Alexander, and Janoris Jenkins. Okay. Don't have a middle linebacker yet. We probably get a corner. I need another corner that's better than an 82, so we're going to go Janoris Jenkins, even though his ratings aren't super great. In 16, we have Julian Edelman, Aaron Donald, and Kalechi Ozumeli. Now, I need another offensive lineman. At receiver, I have Odo Beckham Jr., Devontae Adams, and Deshaun Jackson. I need a left guard more than I need another receiver at this point, so... We're going to take Kelechi Ozumeli there. In 17, oh my god, speaking of wide receivers, Julio Jones, Larry Fitzgerald Team Diamond version, and DJ Moore Gauntlet Reward version. Now, DJ Moore, I think, has got some pretty crazy stuff. Uh, his card is actually, in some areas, actually a little bit better than what we see from Julio. Larry Fitzgerald is kind of trash in terms of, like, his overall, uh, like, speed. Like, it's not very good there, but his route running is on point. Oh my god, this is a tough one. I think we're going to go with Larry Fitzgerald, man. I need a guy with high catch and traffic, so we got to go with Larry on this one. I wanted to go with DJ Moore, but maybe we'll see if I regret that or not. In number, uh, looks like 18 now. We got Akeem Hicks, we got Sean Lee, and we have Demario Davis. Now, I don't have a middle linebacker. Do I have a left end? I have Joey Bosa. Okay. 
Sean Lee, I would take. But I'm going to go with Demario Davis here, man. I need him in a linebacker. Got to make sure he's in the right position. Number 19. Oh, my God. Thank you. I forgot we didn't have a halfback. And uh, look who we happen to get right here. Le'Veon Bell. I don't even care what his ratings are. We're taking him. In the final round, give me something good. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Chill. Sean Taylor. Lorenzo Neal. Look, Lorenzo, you're my boy. But uh, I don't need a fullback right now. And Randy Moss. I need another safety more than I need a wide receiver. Randy Moss is my favorite receiver of all time, and it is killing me not to draft him here. I already have Larry, I have Odell Beckham, Sean Jackson, and Devontae Adams. I want to take Randy Moss, but I'm going to take Sean Taylor. That's not a bad pick, but I really wanted Randy Moss. All right, let's see what Deep Wolf got. Chan Bailey, Jadavian Clowney, and Kalenti Ozamelli. Okay. Clowney's what worries me because the pass rush right now is super overpowered, so I'm nervous to see what's actually going to happen here. But let's give it a shot see if we can get a W. Let's find out right now. All right, he's got a three-man front, so I feel like we can actually get past this. Or not. All right, we got second and 11 here. But uh, give it a little shot. Oh, my God. I feel pressure off the edge already. YOLO. Oh, God. This is going to be bad. I regret everything. I regret every... Why did I throw that? Someone explain to myself why I threw that. <laughs> oh, my God. Marshawn Lattimore out here making moves? Oh, my God. This I hate everything. <laughs> oh, no. That was quite possibly the worst play I've made in Madden history, but I thought, uh, you know what? YOLO. Go deep real quick. Wh who is guarding this man? <laughs> he just fell down. Here's Taylor. Whoa, bro, what? That was an animation glitch. That wasn't supposed to work like that. All right, we got third and eight now. Let me get a little bit of pressure off the edge. Possibly, maybe? He's making a lot of adjustments. All right, here we go. Get that pressure off the edge. Oh, my God, my guy got stuck. There we go. Justin Houston got close. Might have been a late hit, but we'll take it. Ooh, that's good. 3 0. All right, I need a good drive here. Nothing stupid like I did last time. That was honestly a pretty bad fail. There we go. Smart play. Second down and short. He's probably expecting a run. So we hit him with the play action. Got a guy deep. No way he intercepts that. And let's go down to the 39. All right, second and 11. Oh, okay. okay, Le'Veon. I see you. I see you, big fella. Second and nine, field goal territory. Nothing crazy like last time, man. That's what honestly hurt me. Oh, my God. <laughs> God bless America. Oh, my God. Earl Thomas, thank you. Yo, Tyreek Hill. Oh, he's so fast. Oh my god, three seconds left. We might be in field goal territory. I can't I can't even hit that field goal. We can't even hit the field goal, so we gotta go do something else. Yeah, we couldn't get that. Oh my god, hike it. D Wolf's not paying attention. D Wolf's not paying attention. Hike it, hike it, hike it. Oh my god, he wasn't paying attention. Wow. Gotta admit that's uh not exactly how I thought that was gonna go, but 100 percent we'll take it. Gotta focus, man. That's the first touchdown pass we've really thrown, so uh, I need that to come back ASAP. ASAP. Alright, second and ten. Rogers will try again on second down. Dude, the pass rush is unreal. I think like, my, my biggest frustration might be with Madden is uh the pass rush is just crazy. Even when I have a really good offensive line like I do at the moment. It's just it's just kinda wild. Dancing to his left. <laughs> Not exactly the direction I wanted to run on that one. All right, so we can't actually make this pass, so or we can't make this field goal, so I got to go ahead and pass on this one. No chance. All right, I'm worried about Tyree Kill running one on one with Jalen Ramsey on the edge, but I think he might be okay. Speed differential is obviously there. Oh God, I called it. Yeah. Mentioned it, watch what happens. 
the middle of the field. First down. Now what he's trying to do is use his body to keep the defender away from the football. There we go, Larry Fitzgerald. Big play. Have not been able to run in this defense the entire night. We're going to try it here. Le'Veon, fine. That's the biggest. He got more yards there than he's had all night. Second and five. Now Rodgers throwing on second down. Oh. I'm going to get him to eventually let me get that big route. All right, this might be the play that we end up gambling deep. We're going to... Gambling deep has not worked out for me. So we're just going to play it by ear and see what happens here. Get rid of it, Aaron Rodgers. Thank God. All right, that's the first time we've really been able to throw away successfully. So just say I'm happy. Oh, my God. Oh, Millie Fitzgerald, baby. What a play. Oh. My God, that was incredible. All right, we got Tyron in the center. I imagine he's going to try to run it. I'm in a uh, dime right now, which won't be the best situation for me if he decides to run it. Oh, big sack, Justin Houston. Huge sack right there. The turnover here would be, like, real nice right now. All right, he's going to move one guy into motion to the slot. Obviously, a pass here. Oh, my God, is that another sack? Joey Bosa. All right, third and 24. We're going to back everybody off real quick. Obviously, a passing down. No way he runs this one. That was so close to being a sack. What I meant to say is that that was so close to being an interception, but uh, we ended up batting it away. An interception would have been huge. I would have loved that field territory or field position, but it is what it is. Odell Beckham Jr. What a return. What a return. All right, I forgot the clock is like 227. We've got a decent lead. I want to put more points on the board, obviously, but uh, we're going to chew the clock a little bit. Oh, he's using a timeout. All right, so Wolf realized what I was doing. He burned a timeout there. We're, uh, we're about to see what happens right now. Let me get a double slant in. I'm putting Beckham on a streak route. That safety moves. Shotgun now for Rogers. Wide open. Boom. Let's go, Larry Fitzgerald. Let's go, baby. All right, we got a two minute warning. We're in field goal territory. Let's get a run to the edge. Oh, God, it's so hard to run in Madden 19. All right, D Wolf assumes that I'm going to run it, which he's correct. In that assault. I'm going to make him use his last time out here. Okay. This is big. This is a big third down. We get a first down here. It's it's a GG. A first down here means GG. I got to imagine he's going to blitz. Moving guys all over the place. Oh, God. I didn't mean to float that. Oh, no. All right. You never know what would have happened there. So, I'm kind of glad we floated. I just got to make this field goal. Please go in. Right down the middle. Seven point lead with a minute 41 left. All right. Here we go. First and 10. Tyrod again making a couple of adjustments here. I'm always nervous when you see a quarterback make like a zillion adjustments. You're like, yo, what do they see that I don't see right now? Oh my god. Dudes in the flats have been killing me, but we kept him in bounds, which is huge. Oh wait, what? He got out of bounds? Didn't look like it to me, but uh, okay, it is what it is. Alright, put a guy in the flats on the right side. He's back to throw. Escaping the pressure right. Yo, no one's guarding him? Bro, what? All right, we got a lock. We got a lock up here, man. That's un unbelievable. No one was over there. Oh, oh. I thought he was going to deviate to the left. All right, here we go. Shotgun by himself. No, no help there for Ty right if he blitz. I'm going to fake blitz. Oh my god, what just happened? Okay, here's my strat. Put in the guys to the edge. We're covering the flats here. We're in man. Got a QB spy. QB spy is my responsibility here. He's got three seconds left here to get this one off. I knew it was going there. We almost picked it off. I saw it too late, though. All right, he's only got a little bit of time left to throw this one. I'm honestly going to drop back my D-tackle. I'm dropping back. I'm not even rushing anybody. Oh, he got a delay of game. All right, here it is. Fourth and goal. Going for it right here. I'm dropping defensive lineman back. No. Let's go, baby. That's a GG. And ladies and gentlemen, the best formation in football 
the victory formation. No, it is a QB Neil, but for right now, it's a victory formation. Heck of a game with its Debo. For guys, again, there's a video on his channel. Make sure you guys go check that out. This was an unbelievable battle. Not a lot of offense, but boy, that defense was full of some high-level gameplay.